Hi, I'm Mike Elliott, and you're watching the CEO Roadshow. Today, we're joined by Mr. Edward Carr, CEO of U.S. Gold Corp., a gold exploration and development company. They trade on the NASDAQ under ticker USAU. Good morning, Ed. Thanks for being on the show. Good morning, Mike. Thanks for having me on the show. So, Ed, start off. Tell us about your background and what U.S. Gold Corp. does. Uh, sure. Well, U.S. Gold Corp. is a U.S.-listed gold exploration and development company. We're on one of the major U.S. exchanges, the NASDAQ, symbol USAU, so U.S. Gold. And we have two projects in the company, one in Wyoming and one in Nevada. My background, I am a financial capital markets professional. I've been investing in the natural resource industry for over 25 years, been on the board of several different mining and natural resource companies, and I founded U.S. Gold Corp. back in 2014. Next, uh, tell us more about the Keystone Project and what your development plans are there. Sure, be happy to. So Keystone is what I call our exploration unicorn, and we're very excited by it. It is a project located in Nevada on one of the major mining trends called the Cortez Trend, otherwise known as the Battle Mountain Eureka Trend. So we are about 10 miles south of Barrick Gold's Cortez Hills Complex. This is a wonderful location, fantastic piece of real estate. We have a district scale opportunity. That means it's a pretty good land package. It's about 20 square miles, six and a half miles long by three, three and a half miles wide, 12,000 acres, 650 mining claims. This is BLM, Bureau of Land Management Ground, so we lease the claims from them. We've been hard at work in the Keystone District over the last three years. We've done a tremendous amount of geological work from mapping to geophysics, gravity surveys, geochemistry, extensive drilling, and we are very, very excited with where we are at today. Uh, we believe we are very close to potential discovery success. And right now, as of July 2019, we are literally deploying a drill rig to the property. We should have it on uh, property on the on the site by the end of this month and we are going to start drilling and we believe that all indications are there that there are major type Carlin deposits potentially uh, on the project. And Ed, is U.S. Gold Corp currently looking at other geographic regions right now? You know, we, we pretty much have our hands full with our two projects today. So with Keystone in Nevada and Copper King in Wyoming, uh, these are two fantastic, great projects. But I'll tell you, this is an interesting time in the industry. As probably a lot of your subscribers and viewers know, gold is just starting to take off. We're about 14.25 an ounce today, about a six year high. A lot of us in the industry are very excited. We think that this could be the beginning of a new bull market. This natural resource industry, it tends to really run in good bull markets and then crash hard in bear markets. So if you can get the timing right, you can do well. And that being said, there's still a lot of opportunities in the junior space, the exploration space. So we are very opportunistic. If we do see another project, especially in great mining locations like Nevada or Wyoming, we would certainly take a hard look and be interested. Ed, what else should investors take note of right now when looking at U.S. Gold Corp.? Well, I, I think, again, the timing I talked about is great. When you look at us from a value proposition, our project in Wyoming, Copper King, that's the real meat and potatoes of the company, the real value. We know we have a deposit there. We know we have a major resource. We have a preliminary economic assessment report done on the project. Shows a very, very robust $178 million net present value. We also believe there is upside to that project. So I think investors can really hang their hat on that valuation. And then there's the upside from Keystone. If we can get to a discovery hole and have discovery success this summer, we believe that has the potential to create tremendous shareholder value for us. So there's real catalysts coming. We're gonna start drilling, as I mentioned, right now, the end of July. We will drill all through August into early September. We will send those results to the assay laboratory. We could have assays back anywhere from 
mid-September to mid-October. We've had some delays with them in the past, might even be the end of October, but that's when the value creation event comes. When you get those asset results, you release them to the market, and if there's a major discovery hole, then it could be quite exciting. Well, Ed, it's an exciting story, really an exciting time to take a look at gold stocks. So we encourage all our investors to take a look at U.S. Gold Corp. We'll continue to follow the story here on CEO Roadshow and hope to have you on again for another update in the next month or two. Ed, thanks again for your time and for coming on the show. Thank you so much. Thanks for the interest. And we love to come back and update you in the future. Take, take care. care. You, you too. too. You've been watching CEO Roadshow, and we've been talking to Mr. Edward Carr, CEO of U.S. Gold Corp., a gold exploration and development company. They trade on the NASDAQ under ticker USAU, and you can learn more about them at www.usgoldcorp.gold. Thanks for watching CEO Roadshow.